Or not. Good morning guys, we are at the park this morning getting Bo's energy out. It's like my favorite time of the week, I know we've said that. Emma fell asleep in my arms, we decided not to bring the stroller this time just because she doesn't really like the stroller that much when we're going like on a short walk. They're best when we go to like the store or on a long walk, but not so much for the park. So we're gonna throw the frisbee around a little bit more and then Justin's got some work to do at home, huh? I guess he's carrying his frisbee all the way home for us so we don't have to touch it. Oh, the leash is all kinds of mixed up. Come here. What a good boy. What a good boy. You happy? Yeah, she's so cute. This she's so cuddly. I love it. <laughs> oh, good boy. You can't get your frisbee home. <laughs> what a good boy. Okay, so question for all you moms or nannies or anyone who's really baby carried at all before. She loves her wild bird slings that we have. Like they're her favorite, especially they're great on like the weekends when we like go to church. She loves them when she's tired, but when she's awake, they are not her favorite because she wants to face out and not in. I know you can front face in the wild bird, but it's kind of difficult right now at her age and it's, I don't know, it's just not easy. But we have officially booked Emma's first airplane flight and I'm really excited and absolutely terrified. My anxiety it almost caused me to not like schedule the trip because I was so anxious about it. But my number one thing that I'm thinking I want to help with the trip is a baby carrier where she can forward face like right here on my chest. I didn't want to get like a super expensive one because I don't know if she's going to love it and you just don't know. And so this is the one that a lot of people recommended and it's actually on sale on Amazon right now. I think it's called the Lilla Baby Carrier and it's I was just going to get the plain black one and the only reason I'm really considering right now is because it's 20% off on Amazon right now, which is a pretty good deal. So it'd make it closer to $100 instead of 130. But let me know if you guys like that one. I've gotten a lot of people tell me they do. So I think it would really help on the airplane, but I'm not really sure. But yes, her first airplane trip is scheduled. We are flying for about five hours. So it's gonna be a long flight. So wish us luck on that. That'll be next month. And make your guesses in the comments of where you think we're going. You are so stinking cute, little guy. Okay, I don't really know what's going on, but Emma has been napping from 9.30 to it's almost one o'clock. Best morning nap she has ever taken. So she's probably gonna wake up pretty soon. And I just got, oh, it's perfect. I just got the onesie in the mail that's gonna go with her Halloween costume. Another hint. A lot of you guys guessed right, I will say that. Uh, we haven't really been like hiding it, hiding it, but look how cute this little onesie is anyways. Okay, so this is from Quincy May, that's the brand, but this goes with her Halloween costume, so now it's officially ready for on Wednesday. I am so excited. Except for I still haven't gotten mine in Justin's yet. I love getting these coupons in the mail. Emma, are you ready to wake up now? <laughs> That was like the longest nap. Don't lick her face. That was like the longest nap you've taken ever. I don't know what's going on. 12 seconds later. Or not because I walked away for, oh, okay. Are we getting up? Look at that wake up face. She is so happy right now because she got such a good nap, huh? Are you guys ready to see the cutest thing you've ever seen in your entire life? Oh my gosh, you guys are so cute. Bo was sleeping on the couch and I was like, I'm gonna try and get a picture of them together. And I thought he'd probably get up, but he has not moved. He's totally loving it. She's loving it. Do you love it? Do you love your brother? You guys are so cute. Oh my goodness. I am so glad I was able to get a few pictures of them together. Oh my gosh, look at them.
Hi. Hello. Hi, handsome. How's work? Good. How are you? I'm good. Sorry that we can't go to sushi because I'm busy. I know. We're going to go to Pokey instead, which is basically the same thing. Guys, our favorite sushi place, if you've never had it, is called Jin Sushi. It's right there. Temecula, but there's right like. Kmart. Yeah, there's like it's a amazing, million people outside. But there's like so. eight people waiting. We're outside. just going to go to Pokey. Do you want to get her out and I'll yeah, get the stroller? How's your Poke? Asked me that right when I put food in my mouth. It's good. <laughs> good. Those of you that don't know what pokey is, it's literally sushi in a bowl. That's all it is. It's, it's like sushi raw in a bowl. Sushi, yeah. So if you don't like, like if you don't like cooked sushi, a, a lot of sushi is raw too. So, but yeah, so it's all like raw fish. Ooh, I get spicy awesome. tuna. I get ahi tuna. Or so, what do you get? Salmon. Only you salmon. Got raw salmon. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it's really good. And you get white rice, crab meat, and all your toppings and stuff. It's literally just sushi in a bowl. And it's right down the street from our sushi place that's busy, so. We found a Halloween store to go look at for Justin. Yes. I'm excited. Guys, I love Halloween. I haven't been to a store like this in forever. We just came in the Halloween store, and Emma <laughs> literally lost it. I don't know what happened. I think, I think she, she got scared something by something. She it was so it. random. She was like, good. And then all of a sudden, just went. <sighs> I hope she doesn't do that on the airplane. That would be terrifying. You good girl. She's okay now. You're okay. She just wanted mom and dad. I, I guess, guess so. I she was tired on. of the car seat. But oh my gosh. So she could be a Bambi. That's a Wait, I was this costume when I was a kid. I was the Lion King. You were? Uh huh. I had like one just like this where it was like a giant head. Simba? I was Simba or the girl. I think her name is Nala. Nala. Yeah. yeah. Oh, the Disney baby. Yeah. I, is that a dog? Holy moly. Okay, well we were looking while we were in there to see if we had um, a few things to finish our costumes. Oh, people don't see us apparently. I was looking to see if they had the last few things that we need to finish our costumes for Halloween, but I think instead we're just gonna make them, right? Baby, I'm sorry, I can't hear you. Justin's going uh, deaf. I said we were seeing if they had the last few things that we uh, needed, but right. I think we're just gonna make it up kind they of. They sell like full costumes Hers there. is done, so for us we just kind of need a few more things. We just need, oh yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Secret. I can't Justin, say. this is YouTube. We gotta keep it a secret. But instead, we're gonna walk to Carter's, which is literally like in the same parking lot if we don't get hit by a car again. And again, dramatic. If we don't get almost hit by a car again, we're gonna look for some tights for Emma because she has a few pairs, but they're always dirty and her little toes are always freaking cold. So I'm gonna see what else they have there. And yes, they're still gonna be under her onesie. Sorry to disappoint. I think our baby should be a model. I mean, I look so. at, she's just as cute she's as those perfect. babies. She's way cute. She's <laughs> are you kidding me? <laughs> she could be a model. We're gonna walk in here, people are gonna be like, <gasps> The new oh Gerber God. baby. Yeah. Okay, they didn't have tights in her size for some reason, but we got these leggings, which are like tights. And then me and Justin saw this and we were like, she needs this. She, totally she needs to be a unicorn. Ooh, you are a tutor. And she's stinky. Yeah, stinky. Sorry. <laughs> Justin was texting in the store and I was like, who are you texting? A girl? <laughs> yeah, he's like, yeah. he's yeah. like, uh, Harold. Harold? Yeah. <laughs> if you guys don't know who Harold sure. is, it's Harold <laughs> from Earl's Fam. And it was really funny though, because I was like and then I was totally teasing him. And, and he was totally on stuff. autopilot like, she's like, blah, 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 blah. And I was like, oh, great. And I was like, that was the most obvious no, autopilot like, answer I, like, I have ever heard. Saying? Because I was talking about the weather and he was like, uh-huh. And I was like, what did I just say? And he was like, I'm so sorry. I, I was like, realize it. rude. It was so Completely bad. an autopilot That's answer. That's what you get when you get a dad holding a baby, texting in the other hand. Texting another man. Trying to listen man. to what his wife is saying. That's just a bad combination. Texting right another there. man. Yeah. <laughs> Please tell us when your baby stopped hating the car seat. This is, this breaks my happens. heart every time we have to put her in here oh, because she hates it. We're going home, baby. We're going home. home, baby. Guys, Moana's on Netflix. It's I haven't seen Moana in, so how long has it been since you've seen Moana? Uh, well, you were deployed. Yeah? I think the last, actually, you know what? I think they played it when I was on deployment too, on our ship, and I think I watched it again then, but that's probably the last time. We had kids, so we have an excuse to watch Disney movies, but I put it on, and two seconds after I put it on, she fell asleep. Guys, I think that having kids is really an excuse to pretty much do anything that you enjoy doing when you were a kid. Trick or treating, that's gonna happen in a couple days maybe. It's gonna happen as she grows up. Are you um, gonna take her trick or treating? We haven't even talked about are like this are year? going trick or treating? This year? Yeah. I don't know. We'll see. Okay. So she's calm, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, are you gonna try and sit down? Yeah. Okay. 
We know how this usually goes, so let's see how she does. Success. The problem is, she has to wake up within the next 20 minutes to eat before she goes to bed. Me <laughs> this is dangerous territory to be Maybe, walking on. I think it's called like a, a dream feed where they eat like in their sleep. Maybe she'll do that, but we also have to put like the sock on her. So it's like eating within a dream. It's called it's like dream inception. Feed. It's called boobception. Very nervous <laughs> because I feel like you're gonna lick her and wake her up. Staring at Mama, Mama, wants to kiss. Bo, if you lick her head and wake her up, <laughs> Mom's gonna I will lose. destroy you. Money. Thank you. Guys, this is crazy. She's Emma tired. hates when I do this. She literally will not let me sit down mm. when she I'm must holding be her. Tired. I don't know what it is. Like, I'm gonna hold that against her for her whole life. I'm gonna be like, I hope you know that when you were growing up, like, you would never let me sit down when I was oh. holding you. You always made me. What? Is he drooling on he you? He just drooled right down my arm, and I can't. Bo, oh, that wow. is disgusting. But he is so cute. Oh my god, I love you, buddy. <sighs> well, that's it for today's vlog. You good? She's Hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll see you tomorrow. We love you guys. Have a great night. Bye.